just stop talking about philanthropy and start talking about Texas, mm -hmm. Texas, Texas. There's been a call by Congresswoman Ocasio-Cortez to tax uh, people earning over 10 million at a 70% tax rate. The current top rate in the United States is 37%. Uh, Michael Dell, do you support this? I feel much more comfortable with our ability as a private foundation to allocate those funds than I do giving them to the government. And I don't think it would help the growth of the US economy. Well, name a country where that's worked, ever. United States. <laughs> <laughs> Briefly, in the 80s. No, no, no. For From about the 1930s through about the 1960s, the tax rate averaged about 70%. Um, at times, it was up as high as 95%. And those were actually pretty good years for growth. Name me one country where a top marginal tax rate of 70% has actually worked. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I'm a historian. The United States, that's where it has actually worked. In the 1950s, during <laughs> Republican President Eisenhower, you know, the war veteran, the top marginal tax rate in the US was 91% mm -hmm. for people like Michael Dell. You know, the top estate tax for people like Michael Dell was more than 70%. I mean, this is not rocket science. Mm -hmm. I mean, we can talk for a very long time about all these stupid <laughs> philanthropy schemes. We can invite Bono once more, but come on, it's, we gotta be talking about taxes. Yeah, exactly. That's it, taxes, taxes, taxes. All the rest is bullshit, in, in my opinion. <laughs>